Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. My name is Jasmine. And for today's video, I'm going to give you guys a spring makeup look because we are going into spring and I am like so excited. Winter is going to be over with. Like I love spring, summer, and fall. Like those are my favorite seasons. Winter is not my favorite but let's go on i'm gonna do a get ready with me makeup tutorial for spring glowy skin some pop of color on the eyes so i hope you guys enjoy it if you do don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you leave and yeah let's go ahead and get started okay let's so let's jump in to primers i'm gonna be using the elf putty primer and then this one from touch and soul this is the no pore blem primer so i've been loving these two primers together it's been really really good i'm sorry about the sun going in and out it's like playing me right now so i'm just gonna put the putty primer first and then i'll put the other one on top so i love this primer guys if you guys haven't seen my new drugstore makeup releases video the must-haves like this is like a must-have like you need this primer in your life it's just so good absolutely in love with this it's so good makes your face super flawless with the makeup on top like i'm all for this primer this is so good this primer and this is like more like of a hydrating primer because it's more like hydrating for some reason i don't know i never had like a poreless primer be so hydrating like this one this one is really hydrating and i like it it's really good so i like mixing them i never like mix two fun, uh, primers together but these two together have been so good so absolutely love okay, it so for foundation i'm gonna jump in to the l'oreal infallible 24 hour fresh wear foundation this guy is so good if you haven't tried it definitely try it out i got mine in the shade 470 absolutely love this foundation this is such a nice like satin finish i would say satin fresh finish because guys this is not matte it's very nice on the skin and i just i love the way it makes my skin look like i'm telling you so so good haven't tried it definitely try it out because it's really good and i love to apply it with a brush because i feel like it applies it good when i do it with the brush but i also like to go in with the sponge also and blend it out um with the sponge because it takes away like any harsh lines like like the brush might leave on your face so that's the reason why i like it both ways so now that i blended it in with the brush i'm gonna go in with my sponge and this is the elf sponge that i was like obsessed i'm still obsessed with it i still love it it's still one of my favorites but i'm like been obsessed with the um wet and wild sponge like oh my god that sponge is so good and for three dollars i think three to four dollars it is so good okay, so let's move on to the eyes i'm gonna prime my eyes with this elf primer and i don't think it has a shade it's just says a sheer on it so i've been loving using these primers i usually only use like concealers and stuff but i've been wanting to try out primers and see if the shadows come out better like that just because i've been used to the same old same old like concealer 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 so why not try something different so that is why i'm trying out the primer and so far it's been good i wouldn't say it's like my absolute favorite wouldn't say that but it's pretty good and two palettes two palettes the morphe palette and this is the dare to create palette and it's this a big old palette right here i got this for my sister for my birthday so i'm excited i love the shadows they're so beautiful so i'm going to be using that palette and also this elf palette made for matte's palette and i got this one at tj maxx for $3.99 so cute so i'm gonna be mixing in dabbling in both palettes 
So I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward so we can do this really quick makeup look and then we'll go back into the face and we'll just keep chatting. So let's go ahead. done with the eyes on the top we're gonna go back into the eyes in a little bit but we're gonna go ahead and conceal I'm gonna be using the elf 16 hour camel concealer I'm absolutely obsessed everybody's been talking about it believe you guys this is worth the hype because this is so good so so good last a very long time I'm in the shade medium beige I'm telling you guys it's so good i definitely recommend it if you are looking for a good full coverage um concealer like this is the one for you like this is so good i'm actually obsessed with it <laughs> i'm scared to like run out because i've been using it like every single day every time i do my makeup this is the concealer that i've been using like that is how much this concealer is so good so we're gonna go ahead and set it i'm gonna use the pretty vulgar powder like i've been obsessed ever since i got this in my boxy charm like this is what i've been using because i just love the powder it's just so good and it leaves your face looking flawless all day so i love to use this for the under eyes and to set my entire face like to set the foundation so it doesn't move like this is so good so so good okay so we're gonna go ahead and finish up the eyes i have a setting powder here i just let the powder sit there for a minute just while i finish up the eyes so i'm gonna go back in with the two shades that i was using on my eyes and i'm just gonna go ahead and blend it underneath and just connect everything together so everything looks flawless, of course. So I'm just going to keep building it up until all of that blended out. So I'm going to go ahead and remove the powder. And we're going to move on to bronzer. So I'm going to use the Physicians Formula Bronzer. And this is in the shade Deep. I look for my bronzer brush and this is in the shade deep and I'm just gonna bronze the skin so I can look nice and bronzy so next we're gonna move on to a blush and I am gonna be using a physician's formula blush and this is in the shade saucy mauve now usually I will use like a peachy tone but I've been loving this blush for every day so i'm just gonna go ahead and put blush on the face you 
this blush is gorgeous i definitely recommend it i absolutely love it so then to highlight the face a little bit more i'm going to use the essence brighten up banana powder absolutely love this powder definitely pick it up so i'm going to go ahead and brighten up the under eye a little bit just to give me that brightness and then i'm also going to clean up the bronzer and the blush I'm gonna go ahead and set my face um, right before I put a highlight love this this is the wet and wild rose pal uh, spray gorgeous so I'm gonna let this dry I'm gonna apply eyeliner and I'll be right back to finish up the highlight and lips and we are okay, done so let's move on to highlight so i'm going to be using the i love sarai and dose of color highlight and this is in a soul mate so i'm going to go ahead and apply this this is so gorgeous and so beaming like i've never used this before my sister let me um have it and i'm like obsessed like this is so pretty so gorgeous one thing about it is that it does like if you have a lot of texture it does emphasize it a lot so you definitely have to be careful with that but other than that this highlight is gorgeous so you guys can see like look at how pretty I'm done with highlight so we're gonna go ahead and spray the face again with the rose water love it love it love it so let's move on to lip color so i'm going to be using the morphe lip liner in bite me the mac lipstick cherish and the fancy gloss universal one love this lip combo so let's go ahead and move on to the lips make sure it's dry Okay, love, so this is the finished, completed look. Let me know down below if you guys are loving, like, the inner corner pop of color because I'm, like, all for it. Like, I'm obsessed. Like, I'm loving it. I love doing the, like, bronzy and then the pop of color in the inner tear duct. Like, I'm obsessed with that. Like, that is just, like, my new go-to. I'm in love. And, like, this is what I'm going to be doing for spring and summer is just the pop of colors. I think it's so gorgeous. Like, I'm in love. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye, my loves.